Hello everyone. In this video, we are going to see quickly about how to implement four-wheel differential drive in Isaac Sim, as we have already done two-wheel differential drive in tutorial 6. Please watch that tutorial before starting this tutorial. It will help to understand this video much better. Let's start. Here also I have already opened workstation installed Isaac Sim. Firstly, we will add the ground plane in the environment. Then we need a robot with four wheels, which is suitable for four-wheel differential drive. So let's check Isaac Sim assets. This will take some time to load all assets. Once it is fully loaded, look for a robot, and we can take Jackal robot as it has four wheels. So drag it to World Prim and open this robot. Here you can see its four revolid joints for respective four wheels. Let's take this robot a little bit up and align properly with ground plane. Now we need to create action graph to make bridge between Isaac Sim and Rose 2, but we have already made an action graph for two-wheel differential drive in tutorial 6, so I am here going to update that action graph as per our requirement. You can find this file in the description of tutorial 6, so go to content, tt6 underscore files. We will drag this differential underscore drive dot usd file in world prim. Make duplicate of this action graph. Again move this action graph to world prim and delete the imported action graph. Rename this action graph as 4 underscore differential underscore drive and open it. Now, as you remember we have an articulation controller which provides the velocity commands to respective joints. Here it is giving velocity commands to two wheels. As you can see here we are getting velocity commands in an array of two, that is linear and angular velocity. So in four-wheel differential drive, imagine that it is like having two pairs of two-wheel differential drives, one pair at the front and one pair at the rear. So here we are going to make duplicate of this articulation controller and we will give the same velocities. So select these blocks and make copy and paste here. Now connect the velocity command from differential controller to articulation controller and connect tick to exec in. Now next step is to configure the differential controller block by giving robot specifications. So wheel radius for this robot is 0 0.098 and wheel distance is 0.3755. I am giving max wheel speed 100. Next step is we need to give the joint names to articulation controller. But remember, while giving the joint names for both controllers, the name sequence should be the same for both controllers. For example, if the first entry is left wheel joint and controller 1, then for controller 2, the first entry should be left wheel 2. Let's start with front wheel joints, then rear wheels and now click and make array and confirm that sequence is correct. Now final step is to assign the articulation root. Let's quickly check articulation root so it is jackal. Let's give that to both of the articulation controllers. Now run the simulation and here we are not getting any error means we are done with setup in Isaac Sim. Now to control the robot we need to publish the message on the cmd underscore topic, but in tutorial 6, we have already written a code for it, so here also I am going to use the same code. So open the terminal and go to the directory tt6 underscore files. Source the rows 2 and run the turtlebot underscore joy underscore command dot py python file. Make sure that you have connected controller to your system. And here you can see our robot is moving forward. Backward. Anti-clockwise. Clockwise. This is how you can use this action graph for any four-wheel drive. So let's save this action graph and I will put these files in the description of this video. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. In the next tutorial I am going to show Mechanum Drive System so stay tuned and subscribe to my channel. If you find this helpful please like the video and if you have doubt write me in comments. Thanks for watching.